All right, brand new day and outlets we haven't been to before on this trip. So now we're gonna see what they got. 30% off friends and family still. So we're going in blind. We yeah. haven't done research on this outlet. So haven't done research, brand new footage, brand new um, finds out there hopefully. Yeah, we're then, just uh, here, uh, we're like what? Five minutes early. So hopefully okay, there's no line out there. I don't <laughs> think there's any line. So. Yeah, we'll see. Five minutes early, which yeah, is good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, store number one. Nike factory store. What, Kobe? Kobe AD? Different colorways out here. LeBron's. Retail's 185, but they're selling it for 189. <laughs> LeBron Lowe's. Oh, here we go, the green. Kobe AD is the one you're talking about. Yeah. Other one, Kobe AD. He's doing the research. PG2's 89, way too much for this. Jordan uh, 32 low, 109. And a bunch of these Why Not Zeros everywhere also got chlorophyll which we've seen at every outlet we've gone to 129.99 kids for jordan 13s 134 uh legend react shield grade school 69.99 women's though air max 2017 129 air max 97s 129 124 104 for their 95s Quite a bit of stuff to choose from for the women's Air Max 90 for 99. Back wall, Vapor Max Plus 190. Air Max 270, 150. Air Max 270 in black, 150. Check out these up tempos, 129.99. There you go, Jordan 33 All Star, 175. Looks like the only one they have left. Vapor Max. 190 2019 Opus 69.99 says 11 and a half. Looks like they got Carmelo's back here. Probably the only pair they have left. I don't even know how much. 129.99 size 11. Vapor Max Flyknit size 13 190. Check out that colorway: purple, black. All right, store number two. We got that Burlington Jordans. What is this? Different colorway. Here you go. Here's your cleats. Action! <laughs> oh, they're restocking over there. Let me start from the beginning. Look at this empty racks. Are they restocking? What's up? What's going on in here? Oh man! Here we go. Huge. And even then, low end. Can't believe Burlington has been this bad for us this whole trip. And Burlington was like our number one spot that we're like, yeah, Burlington's gonna make it for us. Nope, just NMDs. All right, women's size seven. And finally, something. Air Max 95. And how much are they? 49.59? 59.99. Hey, one find better than nothing. <laughs> Because it's been pretty rough. Let's see, price tag fell, which means we have no clue how much it costs now. Uh, I think that's pretty much it. Hirachi, you went through all those aisles? Yeah. There's no way. <laughs> this dude didn't even check. Alright, store number three. Marshalls. I can feel it. This is a good one. This is a weird little setup. It's actually kind of dark in here, too. NMDs. More NMDs. Of course. Shocks Gravity. Air money. What happened? What? Oh, he went all the way around. Oh, it's not going to disturb. Ah, this guy. Finally, here we are. Next door, Nike factory store. Black and orange pennies, $99. Pocket knife, $49. Come on now. EXP, JDIs. $89.99. LeBron for kids, $114.99. KDs, man, retail, $150. Air Max 270s. Burlington, Ross, I'll have them. $79. Again with these, $149. Saw them at Burlington. Next door, we got that Burlington. Small Burlington. Look at the men's section. Tiny. So pretty much the same stuff we've seen. These and uh, EQTs, the uh, 270s, seen that one. This Burlington looked grimy from the outside. And then now I guess it's redone floors. Shocks, gravity, air money. It's different. Burlington bone dry. So now Marshalls. This can't be it for men's. 
but maybe restock a little bit. Oh, jump man, quick pennies. Uh, 59.99 Hirachi Elite Jordan Fadeaway Zoom Rev Mayfly NMDs of course uh, the restock now Tommy looks like women's lucky brand NMD Roshi 2 the same winters we've seen these a lot Flex Run Trainers Hirachi Run Ultra Jordan trainer it looks like that's it I think the rest are just boys or uh, kids and infant so Presto fly end and truck so this uh, Rodman's and Katie's we saw this one at the other Marshall's a lot of those out there Presto fly and a Spizike $39.99 small little Kyrie's 24 bucks and let's go to Nike nothing to see here all right, we're here, Nike clearance store. Clearance store, expectations are low, but we're gonna try it out anyway. I don't know where this little man went. Let's see if we find him. Oh, there he is. Anything good? Still looking. People are grabbing stuff. I don't know what they're getting. Uh, yeah, way too much. Air Max Plus, $94.99. Vapor Max Run Utility 190 Jordan 1 Mid 110 Looks like a lot of Kyrie's out here for 79.99 and uh KD 9's 69.99 Kyrie 5 130 Air Max Plus Ultra 99 Jordan 1 Mid 110 It's like like a whole Vapor Max section even the flying it, $99 um, for the 270s, $94.99. Um, this one I actually saw at Burlington, and this is a B grade. It's not even, look at that, B grade in here. Still want 94 for that one. 225 for the Premier, $89.99. Man, price. So I found this Kawhi Leonard Spurs Authentic jersey so they're 20% plus another 30% off um, $29.99 they retail for what a couple of hundred how much 200 yeah so they're the uh, closest to on court which you want to title with the Spurs who knows what's gonna happen to them but people are still buying them like 70 to 90 range even some for 110 so who knows I mean pretty cheap comes down to like 16 bucks or something so Take the risk. Burlington's gotta come through, never say anything like this. Huge. Let's go. This Burlington's kind of busy. Lion's getting a little long. There you go. Indoor. This is a small uh, size seven, size eight. A lot of dressy shoes. What is this? Is this tennis? Yeah, tennis. Size eight and a half. A lot of EQTs. There we go. Spizike. And more of these. Looking for some high-end cleats. Nothing. Spizike saw those at the other Burlington track. Man, that's it. I think Ken's already over here. Nothing? Here we go. Back at Nike. Actually, a different Nike. Uh, so, we've never been to this one. We're set, we're ready. All right, let's start off here. I don't want to rush it. We saw these at Burlington. Uh, saw these at Burlington. 129, Air Max Plus quilted. Air Max Plus 120. Air Max 2017, we saw these at Burlington. A lot of Burlington finds up in here. And 149, Air Max 2017. LeBron's retail, 185. LeBron Low is 99. Each on those 129 109 for the 32s pretty sad look at the kids section Jordan courtside future 54 and the rest I mean not anything even that great mids Air Force One mids women's only two pairs of the Air Max 95 
We got like this pink colorway and then this uh, goldish one. I think we have this one at our outlets. Retail, 160. So, more clothing finds. No shoes, but at least we didn't leave empty handed for once. So we'll take it back and then... Uh, Still empty handed, I want ice cream. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's true. We should get ice cream or coffee or something. And then we might go to the other outlets later on, the ones we've already visited, and see if uh, double and triple check. All right, so Ken went to go park, and we are now back at this uh, Nike store, the one that had LeBrons and other stuff. So we'll probably come back, get the same things. We can go every day, make separate purchases, and kind of build up the uh, inventory. So I might have to ship it back, but at least we're here back at Nike factory store. So it looks like they still got them, but definitely ran out of a full row right there. But mixed sizes, LeBron's still here. They also have, man, 10, uh, 12, 11, 10 and a half of the Jordan 12s and a Jordan 18, Jordan 33. Looks like they got quite a bit of them. Only uh, one missing. Picked up another 10 pairs. So LeBron's in here, gotta ship that. Probably ship them back. Um, the clothing finds earlier. So another solid day, add that on. And we got a lot of stuff to like pack and ship and figure it out. So we'll also probably come here in the morning, get as many as we can, and that'll be it. We'll be done for this out hustled. So I'm back from the trip and a quick little breakdown. So I got the notes right here. Clothing items, looks like projected profit, a little bit under $2,000. So $1,980.79, a little mix, uh, Amazon FBA, eBay, and uh, selling those items. I don't know how long it's gonna take. Some will sell quicker, some will make a little bit more than others. So a little mix. The next three Kawhi jerseys, which we took three each. Um, you guys saw that in the video. They were less than $20. These are the authentic Nike jerseys closest to what the players wear. Uh, you can see, I don't know, some of the details. Might have been a little rough right there. But uh, still selling like $80, $100, some as high as $120. Um, so who knows with that one. Might just be like a patient hold. Uh, 10 pairs of the Kyries. So I brought these back full with box ready to go um and now it's going to be good a little mix of sizes there were 75 dollars and then 16 pairs of a lebron i promise 220 uh 240 some as low as 200 depends on the size and they were like what 140 i think um so you're looking at making like 65 bucks profit a pair um after fees and everything depending on where you sell it um so that total um Kawhi jerseys, we did that. Kyrie's like $450 a profit, projected profit. A LeBron's $850 to $900 projected profit. Expenses with the car, hotel, everything. Hotel was like $280 uh, for the nights that we stayed. Um, Ken handled the car part, so I don't even know how much we owe for that. Uh, so projected in, anywhere between uh, 3400 to 3600 um, on my end with the shoes and the clothing, the mix. Definitely better than staying here in El Paso for our one outlet store. So for me, this trip was well worth it. We're going to see where we go next for Out Hustled. Um, I know we really did a high priority on Nike factory stores and Nike just because of the friends and family sale. So for the next time... Definitely more Ross, Burlington, Marshalls, all of that. But we really wanted to get as many Nikes as possible. And I think we did with like five the first day and like four or five the next day. Visiting as many outlets as possible and really trying to find those shoes that had, you know, less competition, really worth the value. Not all friends and family sales are going to do great. You really have to be picky on the items that are there. And if you find something good, you know it's worth it, then you got to go all in. So thanks for watching this Out Hustled. We're short. We're going to go on to the next one. And we'll see where we go next. Go out and get it.